Hello my friends, yes, yes, this is Matilda and welcome to Tilda's Cookbook. Today's recipe of uh, strawberry swirls, it's a delicious uh, sweet snack or you can call it a little dessert. You can have it ready with uh, as little as only two ingredients if you want to. Very simple in its making and uh, with no work at all, you can have it ready for your friends uh, to serve next to your tea or coffee in no time. So with no more delay, let's get started. First of all, I will prepare my strawberry marmalade uh, filling and here I'm using uh, a homemade strawberry marmalade, very very simple and easy to make, you can find the recipe up here. I will add the lemon liqueur and the zest of one lemon and I will mix everything together. See how wonderful it is with whole fruits inside. It's really wonderful. I have opened up my um, puff pastry uh, phyllo dough and I'm making sure to close any little holes that there might be there. And inside this, I'm gonna spread my marmalade. And as you can see, I've spread it all around, leaving a little bit of uh, space um, around it uh, to make sure that uh, while I roll it, it won't come off. So now I'm going to start rolling it. It has warmed up a little bit, so it's not uh, that hard. But if you think that um, it's gone too much, perhaps you can put it in the refrigerator for a while. But uh, it turns nicely here, so I think it's all set. I'm going to roll it. And as it is, I'm going to put it in the refrigerator for half an hour to set before I can cut it. Okay, after a while in the refrigerator, it has firmed quite enough. So we're going to cut it into pieces now. And the width is uh, according to your taste. I cut them approximately one centimeter wide. Then each piece, we're gonna put it on a tray this way. That's the first one, it doesn't stand very well. Leaving a little bit of space in between because it's going to expand. And on my tray, I have put some parchment paper. So this is my tray. My oven has preheated at uh, 200 degrees, so we'll put them to bake. After 30 minutes, my swirls are ready. The strawberry has uh, caramelized a bit, but uh, now we take them on a plate. So these are my uh, strawberry swirls. I put them on a cooling rack and now I let them cool down completely and then we'll taste them. Okay, now they've cooled down and I couldn't wait uh, to taste them actually. Let me bring it a bit closer to show you. Look how it is. So let me taste it. My friends, it is absolutely delicious. Mm. It's fluffy and crunchy. And I also like to put some powdered sugar on top of course, it's not that sweet because it's just a strawberry. That's a suggestion. You can taste it like that. Mm. My friends, it is fantastic. I hope you're going to give it a try. It's really, really easy to make and really yummy. And I hope to see you back next time. Until then, happy baking. Kekalisa Sorexi. Bye-bye, everyone.